Blessings and welcome to another piano tutorial by Moshua Music. In today's video, we're going to cover um, some chords that you can use for like uh, alternate endings. Uh, you can use these as alternate endings, also turn around uh, in a song. And before we get started, I would ask that if this is your first time on the channel, uh, that you would hit that subscribe button. If it's not your first time and you've not subscribed yet, today is your opportunity. You also want to hit the bell notifications icon because these actions allow us to alert you when we upload new videos and to get this information out to as many people as possible, all right? And so um, we're just going to, we're going to use, I'm um, going to use the key of E flat major to demonstrate this. And we, we just play through some and break it down. So, so this is safe. So those chords, um, when I just started playing, I was just giving you an example, like if you're playing in some type of worship or some type of uh, uh, song and it's turning around, because I'm doing like a one, six, two, five. But instead of doing that every time, you could also, if you was ending a song and you just wanted to add some more flavor, instead of using uh, uh, the, the, the six, two, five, one turnaround, you could do like a six. You could do a six. To a sharp five. Flat at seven. to the one. So what are we doing? Doing the pickup notes on that C. So when you turn around, C is the six in E flat minor. And so when you turn around, when your left hand is going to C, your right hand is doing some pickup notes. C, D, E flat, F, and then you're going to F sharp or G flat. You're going to chord. Your left hand is going to go to B. You do B and uh, G flat if you like. Doing like a, you know, in, in this demonstration, I'm just like tapping that G flat. And then I'm playing the uh, left hand. We got the D flat octaves. In the right hand, I'm playing a, a D flat uh, uh, add nine chord in Roy. And then that's A flat, D flat, E flat, F. I'm doing some pickup notes in this demonstration or the way I'm doing it. And then we're resolving back to the E flat major. Alternate way you could do it, you could use it like that. 
Same chords, but we just doing a little different movement. We doing A flat, B flat, and then we're chording, right? Then we're playing that B major chord inverted. So on the left hand we got that those B octaves, and again we got E flat, G flat, and B in the right hand. Left hand stays the same, right hand just plays a, a different inversion, G flat, B, E flat. And then it goes to that uh, E flat major, I mean D flat uh, major chord, inverted F, A flat, B flat, to another D flat major chord, another inversion, A flat, D flat F, and resolving on this this E flat chord inverted. G, B flat, E flat. All right, so you can use that. That's one way. That's one way you can use as an alternate ending. You can use that instead of a a two five a six two five one turnaround. Uh, another variation of that uh, is um, similar. Let's see. So there's another variation you can do. You can use these in, in worship or even high praise as well. So what are we doing here? We go to the six. It's the first section. So you're going to this uh, sh sh the sharp five. To the five. To the four. In the sharp five, you're playing that B, the same chord that I showed you earlier, you're playing B major. Then on the five, you're playing the, 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 the B flat, and in the, in the right hand, you're playing an inverted G flat major chord. On the four, you're gonna play G flat, I mean A flat, because that's the four, but on in, in the right hand you're playing an A flat minor chord instead of a major. So in the right hand you have an A flat B, E flat, G flat, E flat minor seven chord. So so then you go into to this D flat major again. Showed you this already. To again to that uh, B major chord. Now you're going to a uh, a B minor seven, B flat minor seven. So left hand you got B flat, right hand you got F, A flat, D flat, which is this is an inverted uh, D flat major chord over. You can look at it as D flat major over a B flat, which makes this minor D, B flat minor seven chord. So again, that was. Then you're just gonna go, your your right hand's gonna stay on that D flat chord. Your left hand's gonna go to the D flat. Then you're gonna resolve to that E flat. Another way.
way you can do that again is a different inversion. Same chords, different inversions. So the left hand we got B. Right hand we got E flat, G flat, B. We got this uh G flat major inverted over B flat. You got uh this D, E flat, G flat, A flat, which makes this an A flat minor seven. So that is D flat major in this inversion. B major again. So that was to so B flat minor. Again and resolving on this E flat. And those are some alternate endings you can use. You can use those in worship, you can use those in high praise. Uh, 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 sections of a song also as and as a turnaround, as well as a, a you know a vamp type. And you, some of you have, may have heard this in songs before. Let me know in the comments if you've heard this before. What you might have heard it in. And I just I think I'm gonna stop there. I'm gonna ask that if you if you like the video, like it, share it with somebody that could possibly use this information. Leave me a comment in the comment section, and don't forget to subscribe. All right. Until we meet again, remember, continue to play, continue to pray. Blessings.